Hey Sparks, hey to all my Facebook friends, Twitter, Pinterest, Google Plus, anywhere that you follow me online. I wanted to come along and do this video because this probably is like not a familiar setting to you. I'm actually in Perry, Georgia right now. And many of you see me talk online a lot about money. You see me talking about growing your business. You see me talking about leveraging social media, using the internet in creative ways, and escaping the nine to five. Now, this past few days, I took my daughter down to Jacksonville, Florida, because she's going to the University of North Florida for college. And on the way back to Atlanta, where we live, her car started overheating. Now, the day before was overheating a little bit. Some were like, let's take it to Pet Boys, get it checked out. It was all clear. Um, within the past few months, she had the water pump fixed, thermostat. She's amazing. She takes really good care of her car. So we didn't really think anything of it. So start, I was like, let me drive because normally she'll drive or my other daughter will drive. So let, my, let me drive. Let me pay attention to this. And of course, we prayed a long way. God is such a faithful God. So we headed towards here and, and it went from, you know, going up and going up and going up to hot to ride to pull the car off to the side of the road. Well, you know, thank God police are amazing. And, you know, of course, Everyone's passing by, police stop. And he, you know, told me, hey, let it cool down a little bit. We did. Then it overheated once I started driving again. So I was like, you know what? This is my kids, my babies. They need to be safe. So I drove us up to the first sex that I could get us to in Perry, Georgia. And I'm going to tell you, we were in Kroger's. You know, we stopped at Chick-fil-A, got some lemonade so we can get on some Wi-Fi. And before all this, I called my husband. I need to say that. And he's like, I'm on my way. So he was driving the two hours at least, he said, if I have to be there to you know, follow you all the way home. You're not coming home by yourself. So my husband is my hero. He's awesome. So I saw some people in Kroger's and I'm like, you know what, I'm going to, I'm going to see, they look like they're from here. I'm going to talk to them. So I met this guy named Al and his wife, Shiv Shivana, um, awesome people. And I'm like, Hey, do you know people here? And he's like, Oh, you know, you need to do this, this. I said, can you do it? So he tried to fix it with the thermostat. He couldn't do it. Stayed out till like midnight trying to fix it. The following day brought up somebody to try to fix it. It didn't really work. So here's why I talk a lot about money, growing business, escaping the nine to five. My husband and I are able to help this couple with some things with their business. We had the money to stay in a hotel, to take the car down to this particular place to get it fixed, stay overnight two days, feed a family of five for two days. Um, and I don't have to go back to work. My husband doesn't have to go back to work. We have escaped the nine to five. And the reason I talk so much about this is I'm not rushing for Monday to get back to work. We have money, you know, people all the time, my daughters, you know, understand mom, she's going through college and we're paying a portion, but we're not paying at all. She is responsible for large, for her tuition and we're going to pay, you know, meal and, and lodging and things, but she's paying for her education. And she says, mom, you know, she wanted to do a GoFundMe and she says, people are saying they'll pray for me, but prayers aren't going to put me through college. And I guess what I'm saying to you is, you know, when you're put in positions like this, how are you growing your multiple streams and setting yourself up in a position to win? That's why I talk about multiple streams. That's why I have coaching programs. That's why I have products and info products. That's why I have, you know, different programs and such that I set up. And that's why I'm always talking about it because life happens. It's not necessarily this was an emergency or something bad with Perry, Georgia, because the people here are phenomenal. It was a matter of that life happens. And when life happens, will you be prepared? So that's it. I, you know, was going to type it out, but I said I need to do a video about this. God is faithful. We're safe. Uh, I have an amazing husband that drove down. We met some phenomenal people that have been helping us and we're able to eat and we have a place to stay. So I just want to encourage you to build your streams of income now. You know, that job, you can escape the nine to five if you want. So leave me a comment below. And um, if you're in Perry, Georgia, you guys are awesome here. And just let me know if you had life happen or when you have life happen, what are you going to do? I'll see you in the next video. It's hot here. Woo. <laughs> Peace.